Hi, welcome to Assassin's Creed 3, Sequence 7, Mission 3, Conflict Looms. Uh, it's a multi-part mission, obviously, like they all are, but this one seems to have more parts than the last few. Starts off with following this scout through the woods. I kept getting off my horse trying to stand up. Long story. But you're following him to a guy called Israel, who is here. He gives you a little cutscene and asks you to go and stop the ships shooting cannons, I think. I don't know, I wasn't really listening to it, I'll be honest. But running through here, it says stay in motion to avoid being hit by incoming cannonballs. So all you have to do to avoid damage is keep moving and try not to climb up lampposts. But run, 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 you'll eventually get to the port where there are some soldiers who seem to ignore me. So unless I was really lucky, this bit is super easy to just keep moving. Then comes the tricky bit. It's air assassinating a grenadier. Now I go to the left boat first, but you might want to go to the right one first. Um, you'll see why. Anyway, this method for getting the Grenadier is absolutely foolproof. I did it four times in a row with no trouble. You're going to need to ledge assassinate two people, first of all. So climb up that bit there, come up here, hold on there, and then push attack to ledge assassinate that guy. And that shouldn't be a problem. Then either drop back down into the water or just continue to climb right on the ship. I prefer dropping into the water. And then get to this little gap in the ship's railing. And you're going to wait for the next guy to come. Make sure the grenadier who's patrolling doesn't see you do this ledge assassination. Again, just push attack while you're hanging. And then you're going to go back to the first spot. And if you shimmy to the left again, and get up and hold on to the edge of the railing under here, and then look for the grenadier, you'll be able to see him through a gap here in the uh, railing, He's coming around the corner. There he is now. He's just turned around. He's on patrol. See him? I'm zooming in a bit, but the zoom on this program's a bit weird, so it probably won't do much. But there he is. And now, when he turns around to head towards the stern of the ship, the back of the ship, you want to climb up and perch on the la railing like this. Those two guys won't see you, but keep an eye on the grenadier, and as soon as he turns left, you're going to double assassinate these two. So make sure you've got your assassin's blade picked, Take them out and then get off the ship quickly. Now you are going to just climb back up the side of the ship and get back up on the railing in a second, wait for the grenadier to move on. And then from the railing of the ship you can air assassinate this guy. Wham! So super easy, never any threat and really easy to predict. The guy at the back won't notice you so all you have to do now is go and set the powder off. There you go and get off the ship. Now we're going to do the other ship really quickly, and this is a little bit more risky. Um, it's very, very quick, so you might want to do this first in case it backfires. But you climb up here, and basically wait for the two generals with the furry hats to do their patrols, and when they're both not looking at you, see there's one on the far left and one just here now. As soon as he goes past you, you get up, run like crazy, and I've slowed this right down. You'll see you've got a very small window to hit plant. And when you do that, whether or not the other guys have seen you, it'll reset their visibility. So then you can get off the ship, there you go, and uh, detonate it. Job's a good one. And then simply climb the mast to set the flag. So yeah, basic tips. Um, maybe do that boat first. Ugh, I hate climbing the rigging. Maybe do that boat first, and then for the grenadier, uh, take out all the other guys first, and don't worry climbing on, up on the mast, because it's too high visibility and it's too easy to get spotted. Anyway, hope that was useful. Lots of love. Bye!